Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. Good evening, I'm Kristen Dubill. Here are your headlines from 41 Action News on this Wednesday, July 10th. The KCK Police Department is investigating a double homicide that happened inside the Edwards Original Corner Market in Delhi. That's located at 81st and Mill in KCK. When police arrived, they say a suspect fired shots at them. They returned fire. The suspect is now in custody. Police are still sorting through this developing story, trying to figure out who the victims are. But Officer Jonathan Westbrook with KCKPD told us the violence has to stop. Unfortunately, I mean, we live in a world where there's, there's people have incidents and situations where violence tends to be the end of it. Um, and so this is something that we handle on a daily basis. Unfortunately, sometimes it does end in, in the death of an individual. Um, and so, I mean, it's just, just um, another tragic incident. And, um, you know, if, if individuals are having issues, violence, of course, is not the answer. The best way to work things out, you know, just give us a call so we can be the mediator. I mean, our job is to help mediate. None of the KCK police officers involved were injured in this shooting. You can stay updated on this story by going to our website, KSHB.com, or our app. On Wednesday, KCK Police Chief Terry Ziegler announced he is retiring. That breaking later today. His last day on the force will be September 11th. He says he's retiring to focus on a new business. His retirement comes in the midst of a criminal investigation to determine if he broke the law concerning a lake house deal. As Missouri prepares to hand out medical marijuana dispensaries, uh, different cities are planning out where they can actually go. And Independence and Blue Springs and dispensaries cannot open within 1,000 feet of churches, schools, and daycares. In North Kansas City, the boundary limit is 300 feet. There is a meeting tomorrow morning in Kansas City to determine the boundary limits. Wednesday's morning storm led to a lot of flooding throughout the city. The Kansas City Fire Department had to make several water rescues as people attempted to drive through the high water, only to have their cars stall out or just start floating. One of the hot spots was along North Shoto Traffic Way near Belmont Boulevard. When drivers went around the barriers, firefighters went, want people to remember, turn around, don't drown. Your forecast is next. Did you know there are many factors up for discussion in a deal? A realtor will look at every angle from your perspective, including crafting a purchase agreement that allows you the flexibility you need to take that next step. Visit KCRAR.com to find a realtor near you. Here is our forecast for tonight, down to about 66 degrees, so somewhat comfortable tomorrow morning. And then a high of 85 Mostly sunny with a few afternoon clouds tomorrow and no chance of rain. That is a promise. All right, we're going to also watch the tropics tonight at 10, so be sure to watch that on 41 Action News. Remember, you get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.